Hello, welcome to St. Mark Lutheran Church. I'm Pastor Kirk Griffin, and today we join together in our Wednesday, March 25th, Daily Devotion, where we begin in the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Jesus Christ is the light of the world, the light no darkness can overcome. Let us pray together the words that our Lord taught us to pray. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not in temptation, but deliver us from evil. For thine is the kingdom, and the power, and the glory, forever and ever. Amen. A reading for today from Exodus chapter 3. Moses was keeping the flock of his father-in-law Jethro, the priest of Midian. He led his flock beyond the wilderness and came to Horeb, the mountain of God. There the angel of the Lord appeared to him in a flame of fire out of a bush. He looked and the bush was blazing, yet it was not consumed. Then Moses said, I must turn aside and look at this great sight and see why the bush is not burned up. When the Lord saw that he had turned aside to see God, God called to him out of the bush, Moses, Moses. And he said, Here I am. Then the Lord said, I have observed the misery of my people who are in Egypt. I have heard their cry on account of their taskmasters. Indeed, I know their sufferings, and I have come down to deliver them from the Egyptians and to bring them up out of that land to a good and broad land, a land flowing with milk and honey. So come, I will send you to Pharaoh to bring my people, the Israelites, out of Egypt. This is the word of our Lord. Let us pray. Holy Lord, we come into your presence to humbly hear your word, to be filled with your spirit. Deliver us this day from our oppressors, from all that hinders us and keeps us from you and a deeper faith. Give us patience and peace. Give us strength and commitment. Give us the power to be your people in this time and in any way you call us. We pray all this in your Son's name, Jesus Christ our Lord. Amen. May the Lord bless you and keep you. May the Lord make his face shine on you and be gracious to you. May the Lord look upon you with favor and grant you peace. Amen. Amen.